we'll use refraction to determine the index of refraction of an acrylic lens. We have our refraction guide here, place the lens in the semicircle marked out for it, and then align our light box such that the ray of light exactly strikes the intersection of the normal with the face that we've marked out. And then I want to mark that point that it crosses the circle and give it, for instance, a incident. And then I want to mark where the light comes out on the other side of that circle. And that's also A transmitted. So I have a matching pair of letters. And then moving my light box, still having the light strike the same point at the face, I can get two new points and again labeling them B and B. And I can get a total of 11 points. Let every person in the group get some. Get some on this quadrant, which goes over into this quadrant. Get one straight through. Get some, another five, in this quadrant going over into this quadrant. Once you have your points, we'll want to take the sine of the angle, and the easiest way to do that is to use a ruler to measure the height from that line to that line. So 1.95 centimeters on this side, that's the B point, and then I would come over here and measure 1.38 centimeters on this side. I want to create a table of all 11 values for my heights. This quadrant and this quadrant should be reported in negative this quadrant's height and this quadrant's height are reported in positive.